also been jealous of how your baby cousin just sits there and absorbs language naturally while you curse your textbook. But have you ever wondered why babies are so much better at learning language than you? My name is Jordan Shasha, and through my senior thesis, I've learned that sometimes in language, having more knowledge can actually hurt you. In order to determine why this seems to be true, let's look at the infant mind. Infants are really good at picking up patterns or abstracting patterns in language. This means that if they hear nonsense sentences like ga la ga or li ta li, they will remember the specific sounds that they heard, but they will recognize the ABA pattern that they all share. Impressive, right? So you'd expect then that the older we get, the better we should get at pattern abstraction. Well, it turns out that that's not actually true. Toddlers are actually worse at it. In fact, they really can't abstract the pattern at all. However, this research with toddlers has only been shown with patterns of shapes never with language. So could toddlers abstract the pattern if they were tested with language? This is the question I set out to answer with my senior thesis. We found that three and six year olds were not able to abstract the language patterns we gave them. This let us know that age is definitely a factor in rule abstraction ability. We then tested another age group, adults. Adults are really good at abstracting patterns with shapes, so we hypothesized that if they could not abstract the language pattern, not only age, but also language must have some effect on language uh, rule abstraction ability. Interestingly, adults could not abstract the language patterns we gave them. This let us know that it's not just that toddlers are bad at abstracting rules, but that our ability to abstract language rules somehow deteriorates over time. So this raises an interesting question then. What is it about language rules that make them so easy for tiny babies to abstract, but so difficult for experienced toddlers and adults? We propose that being exposed to language is actually somewhat of a vice in terms of language learning. When you're an infant, you have no idea what the crazy influx of sounds crashing against your eardrum means. Everything could be important, so you better not gloss over a single thing. However, once you're more experienced with language, you know what patterns, what sounds, and even what sentences are important. At that point, if you try to pay attention to everything, you go crazy. It's like standing in a crowded room and trying to understand every single conversation. You can't, but if you focus in on one person standing near you, you'll be able to understand them. This is the reason that our toddlers and adults could not abstract the language rules we gave them. For them, focusing on our ABA rule is like <coughs> listening to every person in that crowded room. They have enough experience with language to know that paying attention to the rules we gave them are pretty irrelevant to their ability to speak English. What's more, wasting, focusing on those Rules is actually a waste of brain space when they have so many other important language rules to focus on that allow them to communicate successfully. So in the end, maybe the ending to the old phrase, the more you know, should be the worse you do. Well, <laughs> for language anyway. Thank you.